Happy New Year, y'all. It is your old boy, Pilk, and a lot of you guys have reached out to me about this here banner. Yes, I'm going to go ahead and summon on this banner, though I'm going to talk about this real quick because I don't know how deep I'm going to go. I don't know if I'm going to go all three rounds, to be totally honest. I'm at least going to do one round a day, and we've got to the end of the month to decide what I want to do with this because... I could definitely use dupes of that unit, and that unit, and that unit, and I don't really care about her. Could use dupes of him, and them, but then that kind of like comes to the end of the units that I could really use dupes for, because most everyone else here, if I don't have them maxed, they're going to drop here soon enough, eventually. So, and then we get to the units that definitely are, you know, pretty much done. So... I've got some decisions to make. The other thing to consider here is that we do have a good amount of LRs on this banner. And I really could use, especially Strength Frieza. He has never, ever, ever, ever dropped for me. We have an opportunity in every round to get one. So let's just go ahead and do the first round here. See what we get. And I'm going to gauge from that point on whether or not we're going to make two more videos uh, of each round going into this. You also let me know in the comments section, number one, what you pulled, and number two, if y'all like, would like to continue seeing more of these videos. So, none of this is surprising. It's basically guaranteed feature in all these steps. So, I'm not gonna, like, really put any stock in the, uh, in the animations. What I'm really looking for are, like, uh, excess LRs. I'm looking for, you know multiple featured units, multiple SSRs, I'll take that, uh, I believe I could still use dupes of her, so that's really good, now remember it is going to be guaranteed uh, a new, or I say new, a featured unit at the end of each, uh, each banner, so every extra SSR we get is absolutely golden, so let's see, Tech Beerus, Nah, I thought that could have been a fake out. It was not a fake out. All right, looks like it's a double SSR pull, and it is a unit I have absolutely no use for. Actually, I take that back. I take that back. I do have the Unawakened version uh, that I have a couple dupes in, and that's good for Chain Battle, and actually, as it turns out, for this uh, World Tournament. So, yeah, a unit I didn't need, but I'm not going to argue. I actually do think I've got some pretty respectable uses for that unit. Okay. Don't get another give it to me, but we're going to get another Super Vegito. Now, if we get blue, that's that's a treat. Blue, the only time blue is not going to be like a major treat is going to be on the fifth summon. So on this one, I believe we're guaranteed an extreme lead. Or no, I'm sorry, a super lead. I think the last one was an extreme lead. This one's going to be a super lead. Let's see here. So, we got, uh, getting a lot of super class units. Let's see. And then we get Tau. Okay. Alright, alright. Not the biggest treat ever, but, you know, it is what it is. It's an extra SSR. I'm not mad about that. I'm not gonna gripe about it. Let's keep going. Every time I get an R, I really hope it's a fake out. Okay, okay, alright, alright. I actually will take that. That is a uh, that is a very respectable pull, and I could use dupes of that unit, so that's really good. So if we go back out here, the first draw was a super extreme class category leader. The second it was a super or extreme class category leader guaranteed. So it's like a different category leader either time, yeah, each time, basically a different generation. Uh, I thought thought it was extreme then super, but they've kind of switch, uh, switched up this year. All right, so step three is an LR potential character guaranteed. I did not think that was, I didn't think there were two of these. I didn't pay enough attention to this. So this is going to be an LR character. Okay, we got Beerus. Let's see what we get. We're going to get a crack screen here. Boom! Crack screen number one. Can we get a crack screen number two? Nope. Of course not. Of course not. And I shook my phone too much. I didn't like that. All right. Now we're going to get one at the end. A second one in the middle would be a big treat. Okay, new phone. 
Eh, get out of here with that noise. I have seen those units enough in my Dokkan career to uh, just frankly be sick of them. Uh, let's see. Supreme Kai of Time. Android 19. Let's get to it. Doesn't look like we're going to get a second one. So let's just see what the final unit is. Okay. It's a unit I have absolutely no use for. <sighs> that unit has been rainbowed forever. It seems like if there is going to be an LR drop, it's going to be that one. It is so frustrating. Okay, this could be fire or this could be... The status quo. Let's just kind of see what happens here. Uh, now, this is going to be one of the newer uh, category units, I believe is how that works. Uh, I didn't double check it. I just got excited and went into the summon. So, let's just see what we get. It's better not to have expectations. Like I said, having an extra LR was a treat, but, you know, expectations were a little high. Extra SSR, I'm not mad about. Now, it is going to be a featured unit on the end. Let's see which one we get, because I could really use a couple of the more recent uh, SSRs. So, let's see what is in store for us here at the end of this one. Android 13. All right. I'm not mad about that. I am not mad about that. Oh, new phone. Ooh. Hey! Double featured. Hells yes. And Bojack. 13 and Bojack. I think 13 is now rainbowed, and I believe that's my first uh, dupe of Bojack, so I will take that. that. That's the kind of stuff that really makes me want to second guess and actually do rounds two and three. Uh, but let's go back out here one more time. So that is a really, really, really good summon. Uh, this last one is a potential LR character guarantee. So we have two guaranteed LR steps. Let's see what he what we get here real quick. We'll make this fast. And uh, you guys let me know if you'd like to see... Uh, if you'd like to see the other two steps. Because, frankly, I've got a lot of these LRs rainbowed. If it's another one like Super Saiyan 3 Goku, I'm not going to be excited. That unit really does not intrigue me anymore. Ooh, double screen crack, though. I'll take that. And right out of the gate, we have a tech hit that I don't need. Ain't mad, though. It's an extra SSR. Uh, I can start working on the Unawakened version. So we got an extra Dokkan Fest in there. That's kind of nice. Let's see. And I know people are going to get mad at me for dogging on... Ugh. It is what it is. It is what it is. Expectations were a bit too high on that one. All right, let's go. Let's see who the uh, guaranteed is. I'm not the only one, right? Okay, okay. Actually, you know what? You know what? I could use a dupe of that unit. I still don't have the strength uh, Frieza, though. Strengthful Power Frieza has not, he just will not come into my possession. I don't know why. You know, I'm going to be honest. The, these were really good summons, so I think actually I might go farm up some, uh, some Dragon Stones. I do have quite a few I can farm up. We've got the rest of the month to do it, so actually I think we might, we might actually do that. So let's see what happens here, guys. For now, that's going to be the video. Let me know what you guys pulled in the comment section down below. Like, comment, share, and I will catch you all on the next one.